The commission has heard there were no tender specifications, nor was there an open tender process in the awarding of an irregular tender. According to a previous witness, six airlines were simply invited to Sun City to make proposals for the Mafikeng and Pilansburg airport routes. They also alleged that Professor Job Mohoro, who was acting DG in the office of the Premier at the time, authorized the 50 million rand payment to SA Express, but Mohoro maintains that he relied on the MEC and other officials to satisfy himself that proper procurement processes had been followed. I was aware of procurement processes because that was reported on, on at ESCO, but when that was, I don't have the We'll come to whether it was actually a procurement I, I, I'm, process. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You were aware of procurement processes having taken place? As reported by the relevant department to ESCO. As reported, okay, all right. Yes, sorry. as reported by the department to ESCO. Yes. Which I was secretary of. Yes. But with regard to the nitty-gritty of procurement, yes. I obviously was not involved. Yes. Prof. Mohoro also um, conceded that the 2015 Northwest Premier State of the Province address did not make references to the Mafikeng yes. airport resuscitation. This after he informed the commission that he had relied on the address when he approved the airport's development. Did you manage to find any reference to the airport development in that speech? The, the matter was about uh, the total development of Mahi King. Yes, there was certainly reference to the development of Mahi King. Did you find any reference at all, though, to the specific issue of flights to Mahi King and Pilansburg uh, airports in that speech? I, I, I do not have any recollection of that. Go help me, go ahead. Former SAA Technical Procurement Head Nonsasa Memela was questioned on the two and a half million rand she allegedly received. The allegation is contained in the testimony of Wusil Nzeku of JM Aviation. Nzeku conceded to the commission that the funds paid to Memela, which were allegedly for the sale of land, were in fact fraudulent. We are Jen. Balint Lemtetwa, SABC News, Johannesburg.